Yes. We're on? We're on. It's alive. It's alive. Um, I am e extremely excited and thrilled today. This is the second day of, uh, of this Sweden trip. And today we're probably uh, we're doing the thing that I have been looking most forward to and, and you know, crossed my fingers that we would, we would hit spot on. And it seems uh, like everything just comes together today. Today we're fishing dry flies, uh, again for rainbow and brown trout in, in a lake, but in another lake than, uh, than yesterday. Today we're fishing on uh, uh, the hatch that is on is, is the biggest mayfly hatch, uh, uh, the, the, the biggest mayfly that hatches here in, in northern part of Europe. It's called Ephemera vulgata. It is kind of like the Ephemera danica, only it, it prefers uh, still water. Um, and uh, we've just picked up Markus from Hugen Soos, uh, sports fisher, um, the, uh, the company that has a, f a, f a shop here and, and runs the lakes and, and the rivers. Um, and he, he is just completely, completely ecstatic and exalted because um, we hit this hatch dead on. The hatch has been going on for three days, so the fish has just now tuned in to, to eating these on the surface. That's one thing. The other thing is that the weather conditions today are just 100% ideal. If, if, if you could write down a textbook on how the weather should be for this fishing, it is exactly how the weather is today. So, um, we're excited. But, yeah, we're excited and we're probably in for quite, quite an experience today. I think so. The setup is, is, is perfect. The so. setup is great, the weather is great, the fishing is great, hopefully. Yeah, yeah hopefully. Yeah. So now it's just to go out there and, you know, get some. Yes. Go get some. We will. No, I'm going to pack it now. I see the least fish. Uh, that was a pity. I lost the fish there, as, as you saw, but, uh, you know, uh, that, that happens every now and then. It was really, really a strong fish, and it just jumped uh, quite a lot of times, and one of the times it jumped so high and uh, and far that I, I basically lost the line um, and and it, it threw the hook but yeah that's just what happens <laughs> awesome awesome gonna pick up a new fly and uh, rinse and repeat I guess rinse and repeat someone has to do it yeah someone has to do it exactly <laughs> <coughs> I just landed a really really nice fish I'm sorry, but a lot of the action is, is of course, not going to be in this uh, vlog. Uh, but but um, I'm going to use these vlogs as a teaser. Are you pleased, guys? Oh, yeah, very much. Very so, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. The fish was absolutely amazing. It just head and tailed so so nicely. A big fish as well, um, and uh, it went all in all the way into the backing. So again, the quality of the fish here at Hugensos is just out of this world. And uh, and you know they they feed naturally and and uh, and it's just yeah it's it's truly a pleasure to be here. That fish was crazy. Yeah, <laughs> that was a nice fish. <laughs> that was, really that nice was fish. a nice nice fish. I thought I didn't hook him because I was a bit slow on the, uh, but it turned out to be a good thing because the bigger the fish, the slower the uh, the slower the strike. And uh, well, that was a nice fish. Fantastic. <laughs> and just look at the scenery and everything. And uh, you're happy, Stefan, so I'm happy. <laughs> Very happy. Very happy. Very good fish. I really like the fins on them. Yeah, yeah, perfect, perfect fins, fins as well. It just it almost looked like a steelhead. Yeah, strong, strong, feisty one. Beautiful. Well, I, I'm going to go get some more. It's addictive, this stuff. Mm. Just decided to take a break to give the fish a bit of... Yeah, give give them give them a rest, and this is what we got back to. Thank you so much, Hokon. You have done yourself once again. Yes. And uh, I was not hungry before. I just wanted to fish, but now that I see them, I feel the hunger. <laughs> it's been a bit harder this uh, afternoon, but I managed to get some on uh, on a on a nymph. Uh, so I've gotten on the dun, the emerger, and the nymph today. Almost full circle. And one of the fish we killed and we've just grilled, so we're going to eat that now. I was just getting some of the uh, <laughs> the batteries. <laughs> but overall, so far, really, really awesome day. Here you can see a spin spinner just laying on the surface. How they look when they're dead. Perhaps the last fish of the day, but a really, really nice rainbow. Really nice. Nice fish to finish off with. As I said, I had no hair more.
So that was full circle. I got one on the spinner as well. So I've gotten them on the on the nymph, on the emerger, on the uh, dun, and now on the spinner. There is just an outrageous amount of spinners out here, and the fish are really starting to feeding. It's really starting to feed on them. Just really nice. The fishing is over for the day. We got more than 10 fish. Um, a lot of them on dry fly on the Vulgaria. So it was. You got it was, some insanely pretty fish. Yeah, yeah, it was. Yeah. It, yeah, really good and some nice eating. We ate one yeah. of the fish as well and stuff. An insanely strong fish. Last yeah. Lake compared yeah. to the one yesterday. Definitely, definitely yeah. very strong. We went to the back. Yeah, the, yeah, I was into the backing on one of them. It was a, a nice high strong not high but fat strong and uh, in good good conditions and and with really really wonderful uh, you know full complete fins and tails yeah. so really an awesome day fishing for the with with the uh, on, on the vulgata hatch um tomorrow we're driving a bit further in some kind of direction to fish in in a stream i have no idea where that is but we're going to go there tomorrow uh, to to fish in, in a stream um, now that we're here so um, stay tuned and watch for more videos and of course remember all the stuff about remember to subscribe yeah subscribe like remember comment you can get everything on nordic anglers yeah yeah <laughs> check it out, <laughs> yeah, check out nordic anglers yeah see you in the next one <laughs> bye